Okay, today is day three of Turn It On Again, a month of Genesis here on Kit's Rock Review. Yesterday, I told you about my favorite Peter Gabriel era Genesis song, Firth of Fifth from Selling England by the Pound. Today, I decided I'm going to talk to you about my favorite Phil Collins era Genesis song, and it is Dodo Lurker. It comes from this record, Abacab. And for those who don't know, Abacab uh, was the 1981 release by Genesis. It came out in September 1981, and it was the first record they recorded at their newly acquired private uh, recording studio called The Farm, which was located in Surrey, England. It at one time was a farm, and they bought the farmhouse and turned it into a recording studio. And, you know, Abacab was recorded there, the Genesis album, Invisible Touch, We Can't Dance, plus most of the 80s Phil Collins solo records, the Mike and the Mechanics records, and even the stuff that Tony Banks recorded for uh, movie soundtracks. Anyway, Dodo Lurker, it is the, on the original LP, the original record. Dodo Lurker was the first song on side two, and originally it was part of a long suite of songs, but when they recorded Abacab, Genesis decided they wanted to try something different and move away from those suites and medleys, so they cut the beginning and the end of the medley off. It was really 16 minutes long. You can find it on uh, YouTube if you want to really want to see the whole thing. But anyway, so they kept the Dodo Lurker middle section of songs. And um, the song itself, it's about a sea monster. You know, you don't hear too many pop songs about sea monsters. It was a bit, but believe it or not, uh, Dodo Lurker actually got its fair play on uh, rock radio back in the, in the early 80s. Anyway, it's about a sea monster. And my favorite part of the song is actually sort of towards the end. I mean, it's filled with Tony Banks keyboard solos, and I'm always a big sucker for Tony Banks keyboard solos on Genesis songs. But my favorite part, as I said, is at the end, and there's a line at the end, and it goes, and then something spoke, and this is what it said to me. And what it says is a Tony Banks keyboard solo. It goes, da-da-da-da, da-da-da-da-da-da. But anyway, I'm not going to... I'm a terrible singer, and I'm a terrible... I can't play keyboards, but I just... I really love that part. So I'm going to put a copy of the song in the comments... So you can actually hear the sea monster that speaks in a Tony Banks keyboard solo. So that's it for today. Tomorrow I'll have another Genesis song for you. I'm not quite sure what yet. Uh, I haven't picked it out. But until that time, this is Kit's Rock Review. And keep on rocking in the free world, and I'll see you tomorrow.